earlier on today, and I'm hoping he plays the same caliber as well because just just so quick on the trigger, so fast, it's so difficult to, uh, to counter. John Olsen and T both doing their job and uh, actually giving themselves a big advantage here and just extending it just like that full sense. For RRQ, Lemmy Moore, he's been safe. Playing it safe when it comes down to the defense, and I'm not too sure if this is going to be the best solution here because John Olsen is up for the hunt, but Flip actually still gets the kill, and that's uh, going to be a two versus three. T does have that shorty, but the, the operator and Cha La 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 just sings it out. And so far, four rounds already. Flip Sider will shut down John Olsen, who was just out in the middle of nowhere, but. So far, it's been rewarded every time, and Koge won't escape a Pinya, who finds a double kill, turns around for the second one. Flipside and Emma now here to pick up the pieces. That was just chaotic, but now there is a calm. Spike, and Spike has been planted, but Emma and FBS, he has to go big here. He does get one. It's a 1v1, and Flipsider, he does convert and make sure that the first round on the board. Go to the one, they're guarding together with Emma, and they take down one, they more duelist, but there is, oh, what? no! A shrouded step and a Spike kill for Apinia. The Vossel, he must be so frustrated right now as well. We did talk about the fact that he's struggling with kills, kills here, and he's going to lose a fight that he should have won. Oh. Emma finds a triple kill uh, thanks, to that, thanks to that Sheriff, and now Chalala, Currently in a one versus two. I haven't put a turret on one side. I mean, doesn't matter. Lemmy Moore finally gets to use that tool to force to shut him down. Guys, oh, Lemmy Moore does not move at all. There is a Hunter's Fury, but he takes down three with him. That oh is God. just... Revealing area. He's a cavalry on his, on his own, basically. That was a mental shot when he pulled out that headhunter. That was... <laughs> That was disgusting. Flip slider, instant flick onto Chalala's head. It looks like RQ are getting warmed up here. They're tired of getting instantly shut down. Lamy snacks, pushes forward, peeks into four players for RQ. Who's the rolling thunder, but they want to make sure that they have the C site for their taking. And Flip has already gotten a kill against one, but there's more. They want to play this so careful and uses M and FPS's Why? ultimate to get a kill. Nobody just yet, but John Olsen is here in Garage ensuring that they get the kills. And this attack of the Fuse comes in, but magnetic are the bullets of John Olsen. Just the Mimor left all alone. He is rude, he is damaged, and he can't really spike anymore. He get, does get the kill though. There's one walking his way, and he Gets. But it's just a fake. That's just a bait. They, they all want to go towards B instead, where Lemmy Moore and Tuge are waiting for them. No smokes, so it's quite open. Spike they planted. have the ability to push out, but there's a flash for T, but he eventually dies and falls down to the hands of Tuge. Tuge is out for more. He uses the paranoia to displace them, and he pushes forward with no fear. He does another shrouded step. And gets One enemy kill. remaining. This is a two-day show, everybody. No. And he's a monster here. And Chalalala -la -la is left all alone, but Flip takes care of him. Four. You have the C's that you can couple with that pain shell, but immediately that's going to be shut down by just a single piece of smoke. Kills go oh. in favor of our RQ. Lemimor takes down two, and that's Damn. it to the garage. Oh, the but is the garage closed at the moment because T has just used the aftershock to drive them away? Take flight. Lemmy Snacks will use the Aldro, but now they know exactly where he is. And will re peek it as well. My goodness, Lemmy Moore, he is getting confident indeed. Two versus four now. Spike is going down. And it's one enemy coming from remaining. C and A. Well, maybe not Lemmy Moore. Shutting down T, looking for that ace. John Olsen shouldn't really even be trying to go for this. Operator on the retake into the B site when there's <laughs> someone potentially on an ace run. Maybe uh, maybe John Olsen should just sit back and uh, hold on to the operator for the next round. In my imagination, what would happen would be uh, two kills with the operator and then equips the Blade Storm, and then it's going to be a clutch and we finish <laughs> yeah. a 97. That's the... But there's going to be a from the shadows invested here. I do get it. Is it going to oh reward my. him? Yes. He takes down T. 
And then he jumps out to make sure that Lamy Snacks is out of the way before they plant the spike. But Apinya tries his best to do a 2 get cosplay, but that didn't really work out for him. Spike planted. But Lamy Snacks is just right here. Chalalala takes the first kill against Banana. Uses the lockdown, but he's all alone. It's the lockdown in him. Yeah, and uh, with that being your teammate, oh dear, peeks into a triple. And that is going to be RQ finding their 10th round on the board. I have everything to ensure they're safe on the way in, although that is something you can't plan for. John Olsen to catch the cross. Oh, T, you missed a couple of shots, but it doesn't matter. You find yourself a Vandal, and now RQ have to try and salvage this situation. They go towards the A site, which is currently vacated, and that does mean the spike can go down. And up goes Toge. Yep, and I think they've already learned from that lesson, right? La 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 la. Is expecting oh, that. Seconds left. There's even a From the Shadows for a Binion. Got by his teammate. That's so unfortunate. <laughs> he was so ready to peek out. Even maybe placing the turret, but Flip is still making this happen. Double headshot for him. But it's a 1v3 and an operator into play for Lemimor. He smoked out. He has to either push forward or just really be so good with those estimates as to where Chalalala is currently. Last player oh. using the round. Uh, but it's a 30. It was so close. Let me more. And he's just holding this angle. It was Duge earlier on that got a headshot against him. So it might be another oh, one, but no. no, there was the smoke in his hand. Last for player him. standing. And even this is what Ray Ray was talking about, right? Cha la la la. He's his own so thing great. here. He even has enough orbs for another lockdown. And he oh, used that two rounds ago. In opinion, there's a lockdown and as well as the rolling thunder. Well, here it is. That's going to be quite scary for our RQ. Lumimor was stunned, and that's why he was also surprised there by the killjoy. But Flip and Emma just mow them down through the smoke and they're able to get the kill and just like that they're able to probably win this with and able to dodge the lockdown as well you can imagine the, the comms right it's like oh my god chalala how are you doing this finally m-man will shut him down and still is able to just tp away we don't have a dash yes but we don't but we do have the rendezvous and Tebatol is just waiting up the camp. He sees him first. Tebatol gets dinked through that pillar. Tuga strikes back with a kill. He uses the paranoia just in case somebody is going to peek out towards his teammates. Oh, Chalala has to really work. Oh, the timing! Oh, two, two times for Tuga. Tuga. Teleport's ready. And Lemimor is still here to uh, assert his dominance, really. And no one can actually go for that defuse, not even gonna try. And so they have had to hand RRQ match point. Ooh. It's really important that they save that ball for John Olsen because he can do that. MNFBS shut down at the very start of the round and uh, they may be committing here. And finally, Thorge gets punished for it. He thinks he can get away with it the second time. First time, you can let through, but not anymore for the second. T was just so ready, and the Spectre was twice, the, yeah. the perfect uh, gun for that. That's going to be a free upgrade there for T, and so starting things off with losing two of their teammates. <laughs> oh my oh, goodness, that timing. Up. As soon as he hears it go down, he's like, okay, can you, can you flash this, please? And uh, now Flipsider is in a one versus five. But I don't think he's a, he's a quitter by any sense of the word. They will just meet each other. That's, things like that are mental. Like, how does that ever happen? Timing was in favor for Flip there, but it's not always going to be the case. It's Vinya to peek out just as he wanted to plant the spike. The paranoia comes in. And his shoulder is seen. Left. And now in full control is full sense. Uh, they're aware at this point, but they do have to commit now because that spike has to go down and they now have to defend. Pose plant position. Out. Yeah, they, they actually just pushed forward without a smoke for its heaven. Just one paint shell was enough for them to take 
uh, a hold of the site. But there's a lot still at stake here. Mimor takes down Opinia, so no smoke for the retake. A lot of blinds come their way. RFQ takes one, but let me snack. La 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 la, and T, oh. they make sure that we go to overtime, and even That's just Cover going down. a bit of a fast movement here for Fulsen. They don't even just check the corner, but the balls were made by RRQ. And it's just down. one, C. it's like a Thanos snap oh, right no. here in the C site. <laughs> Lamy Snacks falls to it. actually get these yeah. kills, and he says that Emin is there. But the kills, oh no! Oh, 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 oh dear. That doesn't help at yeah. all, does it, when you're killing your Enemy teammate hard. like that? And uh, yeah, you know the cast is cursed. Congratulations to you, Donut. You have inherited the curse, and you are now in a, a, in a smoke. So up front to him so that he can take down. But John Olsen had a view where he currently is, and he takes down two members there on the seaside. But a pinya from behind there, ensuring. But Tebutol is hiding in this corner. It's just down to Lamy Moore, who was just there in a pushed up spike planted towards that whole lobby. And he is all alone. How can he oh, actually he's got pick up no the time to go for this. He, he's taking too much time to go towards the garage. Full send down C long. Oh, dearie, dearie me. Retaking with an operator is Don't already bad really. enough. Retaking by rotating back into garage, shift walking. Uh, it feels like torture. Yeah, th that's going to be something that's. Uh, that would hurt, right? RQ had a plan. It was just immediately released. Probably a big adjustment. Spike down for B. This role, such a big role for him to fill. A fade, probably Stealing not sight. as comfortable in his shoes at the moment. Spike planted. Oh dear, wasn't expecting to. What? How is he still alive? That's ridiculous. The fact that he stayed alive and that One actually gets shut remains. down by the person he missed. But it doesn't matter. His Lamy snacks, Chalala, they've shut down the remaining players. And just like that, Full Sense have found a win over RRQ. Defenders and, uh, win. That was just a push and a pull, a basically a tug of war there for both Full Sense and RRQ.